this is what the living room looks like. <laughs> You're happy as Larry down there, aren't you? <laughs> hey? So we're actually moving things over to the new house today. I don't oh. think we're going to sleep there tonight, are we? Uh, <coughs> well, there's a couple of things still left to come, which will arrive tomorrow, unfortunately. So they're, not, they're not stuff that are priority for sleeping there, though. This is bed. Oh yeah, we've ordered Isabel a bed, long story short. So if you've been watching the vlogs, then you'll know Isabel's got quite a small room in the new house. Anyway, Isabel chose a smaller room. So because she got the smaller room, we couldn't decide between popping a single bed in there or a sofa bed. And she decided that she wanted the sofa bed that was like a lot more money than the single bed. But we were willing to do it because it made bit more cozy I guess in there for her and she said that she'd like to like put the sofa bed up on a night time and then it turns out when the sofa bed's been put in that room now it fits great it looks lovely and then when we like transformed it to the bed she didn't say anything I don't want Isabel to come off as like a spoiled child here because it wasn't even her idea to do the change it was mine and Chris's she didn't say anything but when we converted the sofa bed into a bed I don't think any of us realised stupidly that the bed would pretty much be on the floor. It's pretty much a mattress on the floor, right? It just wasn't. It, did, it didn't feel cozy with a with a, like a the, the bed on the floor, like the sofa on the floor. And she didn't say anything, but if, I was like, oh, I didn't really think about the fact that the bed would be so low to the floor when it was down. And Isabel's like, yeah, I didn't really think about that either. I'm lower than my desk. But I think Marora's got stuck under the unit again. Oh, bless you, yeah. <laughs> Aurora's on the move. So last night over dinner, we were talking about it, and I was like. Would you like a single bed? She's like, oh no, don't spend more money on me a bed. Absolutely fine. Honestly, I don't mind. I'm only sleeping in there. It's not a big deal. Um, but then me and Chris decided, do you know what? Let's just order one. You could tell deep down she wanted the bed. I want her to feel comfortable in there. I want her to be cozy for her. I want it to be what she wants. So we ordered her a single bed last night and she's chuffed. So that's good. And I think we'll move the sofa bed. Should we should move the sofa bed to our bedroom upstairs? It'd be nice sharing the corner. Isn't it'll it? be nice sharing the corner, and also it'll be good for. Sometimes Chris gets seriously jumpy legs, and obviously I'm co-sleeping with Aurora. So some nights when he's disturbing us, instead of him having to come down and sleep on the sofa, which is what he sometimes does now, you'll be able to put the sofa bed out. She's moved back under the unit, babe. If she's back under the cabinet, she's so clever. she's so fast. What are you doing? <laughs> um, so it's worked out well. But yeah, long story short, her bed's not coming till tomorrow, and I forgot about that. But we're moving things over today. It's actually about half past two in the afternoon right now. Chris has not stopped since he woke up. You need to get changed. I feel rancid. I've got like a... You're wearing three shades of green right now and you're... Yeah. It's no, not it's vibing. Not it's not, I've got like a, Can you hear my voice? I've got a throat thing going on. I'm really like... No, you've got a bright green hat on, a khaki green t-shirt and bottle green shorts. And that is not the one. And then green flip-flops. No. And they're all different shades of green, babe, no. Right, we're going down to the side again. Anyway, yeah, Chris has not stopped this morning. He's been running backwards and forwards to the houses for deliveries and internet and all sorts. Now he's just had an hour and a half Zoom chat, which just took up ages. So I was trying to keep the younger three quiet whilst the older three did the schoolwork and Chris was on the Zoom meeting. Now he's off. I've just pulled out all of the drawers that we've been using down here as like toy cupboards. Put them all in the living room floor. I'm going to pack them all up. Guys, if you watched yesterday's vlog, then you might know we, I said we'd bought Mila a little chair for the dining room table because it didn't come with seven, it only came with six. I kind of wish I'd have bought one of these high chairs instead. So cute. You look so cute. Sat there, Mila. <laughs> She's concentrating right now. I think you've put them on wrong. <gasps> Can you work out which ones are not correct? Well, no, no, Jace, let me do it. Wait. I know you're a big boy, you can do it. That's it. There we go. Well done, that's one. I think there's another one that's not quite right. Hmm. Good, that's perfect. There you go, yay! <laughs> you're so clever! <laughs> Wait, which one's the one? No, we do it they're again. all right. We do it again, but make it a little bit more difficult. It's going to run in face. <laughs> <laughs> also, she's sat in this high chair playing this game because the balls just get lost really easily. If they're just on a table, if she drops one, it just rolls off. And they're all going under the sofa and everywhere, aren't they? And, and one of the Iron Man go on the sofa and get out. Yeah. I'll reach the balls. Reach the balls. Yeah, yeah well, right. you know, I, I, 
anyway, this tray is really good. It stops them getting lost. So I was just stuck under Aurora, who just had a big long nap. But she's in a very good mood now, so it's all worth it. You just have a long sleep. Yeah, and we've just been told that the cleaners in the house, they called them. Basically, Chris had to go around there this morning um, to sort out some Amazon orders and things. <gasps> Get that muzzy away from her. No, 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 Thank you. Um, to sort out some Amazon orders and things this morning but they just ba basically rang us and said that they'll be done in the next 30 minutes so we'll be able to go around to the new house. I swear when we've paid for professional cleans in the past in the UK the clean of the house has taken like two hours. These guys have gone to town. They've been there since nine o'clock this morning. It's now nearly 5 p.m. So that has been a deep clean. We've basically been waiting for them to finish all day because we can't go to the house and start filling it with our own stuff from here until the deep clean had been done. We didn't want to take more stuff out there and make their job harder by having to move things around. So we've just left everything here. So we're going to go around there now that I can get up and sort of all right. Although I've just seen that Jason and Mila are fully stripped off in the garden and are playing in the paddling pool. They're living their best life right now. Living your best life, Jace. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Isla is sat here literally hugging. Sorry guys, the battery cut off and I've just had to change it to a new one. But Isla is hugging this watermelon that I bought yesterday. So I think we're gonna cut that open. Yes. This watermelon, Rara. It's a big one. Let's cut it. This is so exciting. <laughs> no, that's, that's making me laugh. Chris's door. <laughs> You've been walking around this house with your shoes on for the last week yeah. and now that it's been handed over, well it got handed over a few days, but now that it's been cleaned, Chris is like, shoes off at the door. <gasps> We've been left water, we just set up a water subscription. We've got our first three bottles, woohoo! Are you excited? Yeah, yeah. Where are you? Oh my gosh. You're not going to see up the room. You're going up straight up to your room? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> There's nothing new in there yet. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, be careful. Yeah. <gasps> oh my gosh, they have. Chris just came out and was like, oh my gosh, they've even cleaned the garden. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh, this is so nice. It's so nice. It feels so, oh my gosh, it feels really weird and surreal. <gasps> oh my goodness. This is so cool. This is just so cool. I love it. I absolutely love it. Look at all this space oh, we've got. The sand feels nice in my wampings. The what? S sand? The grass feels nice in my wampings. Please tell me why you have got a cardigan on when it is 42 I think my degrees. I'm actually trying to get used to it, but it's snowy. Because it's really cold in the house. Right? Yeah, it's cold so inside. I'm not really taking it off. Oh, it's nice on your bare feet. It's on so nice, isn't it? That's what Esme just said. Oh, it yeah, feels amazing. Well. It's nice on my wampings. Oh, it's so cool. This is so wonderful. And I'm going to unbox my he my egg check. Not unbox. No, I'm not actually. I'm just going to leave that packaged up for now. <laughs> oh, she's saying, where are you, Jace? Me, Jace, are you playing hide and seek? Yeah. She thinks so she, she's gone to look for you in the garden. <laughs> Bless her. <laughs> what are you doing? I know all of you guys are thinking, enough of the garden already. We've seen that. We want to see the house. We want to see the whole house. So I'm just letting you guys know that we are going to be doing a house tour. So, so many of you guys have been saying. There's so much space here, isn't there, Jace? Yeah. More space than the other house. Yeah, a lot more space. You love it? Yeah. Um, we are going to do a house tour. We're not going to be waiting until like, the house is fully done and decorated because obviously that's going to take time and you guys don't want to be waiting like weeks for, for us to do. Uh, and we're also, I don't think it'll, it'll be done. No house is ever done, is it? You're always like, oh, you're always adding and things like that. So, um, that's all right. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. So we'll be doing, a, we will be doing like a, an, an un, unfinished house tour and then another house tour in a, in, a, in a month or two when we're completely done but we'll do one over the next couple of days like a proper show like well maybe we'll do it tomorrow when we're in for 
Yeah, we are officially moving in tomorrow. <laughs> so maybe tomorrow we could do like a little, a little run through. A little run through. Because like like, like, the girls are like, oh, I don't want to show. But, well, I'll ask them. They didn't want to show it the other day. They might want to show it now that the beds are in and stuff. I don't know. They can just show they're empty and then finish. Because I think it's good to show like a before and after yeah, of yeah. places. Because we'll be decorating every room anyway. So yeah. Well. Yeah, we will. I mean, the, down here is like with our decor bits that we've got. Yeah, down we've still got a few more decor done. bits. Down here is cool. Got a few bits to add. But, um, pretty much done down here we'll be able to show that anyway what we're here for today is to build so we've bought a few things like uh i've got aurora's um baby walker oh my gosh she's so cute i've got a baby walker that's arrived so i want to build that we want to build the water machine the little corner table the little coffee table thing what else are we building today we've got some garden lounger chairs we'll build those what else did we get so Whatever, we've got a few other bits. Oh, the shoe storage. The stuff brimming out everywhere. So we're just going to get rid of a few of the boxes and things today and do some building. What are you doing? You look so adorable. Well, watch this. Come on. Come here then. Come on the cheeky. Come here. Are you coming? You are. You can do it. I'm falling, Mama. Okay. I'm falling. Go on. Big girl. Put something in front of Ryla on your phone. She's so close to being able to do it. Move her further because she's so good at reaching out. Are they too big? <laughs> I told you they were massive. Go on. Go get it. <laughs> she's like, I don't want now. I want my Mama. Are you coming to Mama? <gasps> What's this? Good girl, you can do it. Come on then. <laughs> oh, she's been such a Ted. <gasps> Are you being cheeky? Right, me and Chris just had an argument because. No, I'm not. Chris keeps putting the camera onto this setting because he says the colouring's better. I think this is horrible lighting. I think it makes me look yellow and it's not good colour. I prefer this colour that gives a more natural light. Like this is the natural light. This has not got no yellow tinted filter over the top of it that just makes me look horrible. Well, not, not even makes me look horrible. I just think it just makes the lighting look horrible. Whoever's filming look horrible, whatever I'm showing look horrible. I don't mean me, I just mean in general. What do you guys prefer? Do you prefer Chris's yellow footage or my normal light footage? I'll just wait for everybody to say Chris's. I'm only joking. Have you turned the aircon off? No. It's not on. Can you pop it on? It might not be on. It's definitely not. It's really hot in here. Suddenly. Check out our sleek, nice new water cooler. We bought it yesterday from Ace. Or the day before from Ace, can't remember. Uh, day before, yeah. Um, we're going to put our first bottle of water on our first ever water subscription in Dubai. Don't pretend you're not excited to see this, guys. <laughs> I'm excited to put this on another life so, because I'm a geek, but you know. Here we go. Are ready? You, sh you said that like you're talking to Aurora. <laughs> you ready? You ready? Ready it's for so this? Cool. So you put it on top and then you just push it down and it goes pop. Boom! There we go, we have water. There we go! We have a bit of water anyway. We hope that's going to work. So we're going to have the table here, the black coffee table here, and then the black cart here, cart here yeah. with the cups uh, and things on. Yes, oh, yeah, we've got them two things to build. Yeah, we've got them to build today. But how do we like working? We're not sure yet, but we're just going to leave it for 10 minutes till we get the coffee table out, the cups and things out, because there's no cups. And Aurora's baby walker. We're going to do Aurora's baby walker as well, that's right. Yeah. My happy girl! <laughs> What's this? She's like, I'm bored of waiting. I want it open. I got with a little roof. Just in case we're in the garden and the, sun, the sun's on her. Oh, what's wrong? Are you excited? Do you know what we don't have? We don't have no batteries. <laughs> this lights up and plays music. We don't have batteries. Get some from a uh, cafe there. Cafe, yeah. Oh my god, what the heck? Why is there about eight million pieces? You might need a screwdriver for that, you know. They don't come tomorrow. No. Where is the play? 
Eight million wheels. Thank you, Mila. Thank yeah, we Mila. definitely need batteries for this. That's cool. Oh my goodness, that was a task and a half. It does all sorts of different things. Like this turns into like a rocking horse type thing. It also has this that kind of fits there, I guess if your baby's a bit younger. Um, oh my gosh, I've got that stuck on there now. Like it goes as like a net thing across if your baby's younger. It also has different height settings. And so we got it on the highest setting by accident. And then we didn't know how to change it. What are you doing? Oh, let's get her in a chair. You want to turn in your chair? Come here. Hey, do you want to lick her down? Come on then. Right, Liz, do you want to push her? Yeah. What's that? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. She's only just though. Maybe we'll have to put that um that this back this in. Do you think her feet are pretty much on the floor, though a full foot's not. <laughs> In a second, Jace. Okay. We need batteries. It lights up and plays music, but there's no batteries in it. But she's going to be so happy being able to be upright. Yay! Do you like it? Are we able to take this in the garden and everything? Yeah, you can push her, Jace, if you want to have a turn. <laughs> just be not too. Whoa, just just be careful, not too fast. Wee! Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> not too fast. <laughs> Jay's not too fast. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you guys having fun? <laughs> look at Aurora's face. I can't wait to get the twinkle lights and things in the garden. It's going to look so nice. Yeah? I don't push her. Why? Because you're too hot. I need you to push her. Uh, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> you don't have to push her. She'll be happy to just sit and watch you guys running around. Guys, I'm giving you a cheeky sneak peek of the living room area. As I can't decide what to do with these blooming floor mats that we bought. <laughs> they were like a necessity. I'm like, we have to have these. I think they're all right, actually, now. I was like, we have to have them because th there, need there needs to be a space where we can sit Aurora and she'll be safe without just slipping on the marble floor. But then Chris said, we put like a rug down and Chris said, let's just leave the rug down. I was like, no, I don't want a rug at the back of the sofa. It looks so weird. Because we do we do have enough rugs to do that? But I was like, no, we bought the mats. I want the mats there. And then I was like, should we put the mats here, going down here, and move the water cooler to like over there? But I don't want Aurora to be like stuck behind the sofa when she's playing. Do you know what I mean? She'll be like stuck in between the sofa. And also the tables going there, the little corner table. Do you think she'll be she'll be like standing there though because she can't see anyone. So she's just like, no, because oh. we'll all be around here in the dining room area, won't we? Playing. I think, I think it's fine. I think it's. But you're not putting your tent up on that. Well, that's what I mean. Like yeah, I do have like a little, um, a little pink like yurt type tent type you thing. Put your tent somewhere else. And I was planning on putting all the toys into the tent, but yeah, I kind of don't feel like a tent in the living room is going to be a great, a great idea now. Oh, maybe the tent can be a garden tent. Oh, the tent could be a garden tent, yeah. But this will probably be fine. To be honest, it's just a space to store their toys. Like we're a family. It's not a show home. Do you know what I mean? We're a family. That's true. No, it's not a show home. You need to get that <laughs> out of your head. It's not a show home. Me and Chris disagree with this all the time. And obviously he's kind of low-key joking, but kind of not joking. But Chris would have the house looking exactly like this forever. And I'm just like, no. We've got a family with young children. It's going to look lived in. There's going to be toys around. And that's what I wanted this space for. So that they've got their toys down here. If they want to take them outside, they can take them outside. If they want to play with them in here, they can play with them in here. And on a night time, I've just got somewhere, I'll probably get a toy box for this. And then I can put all the toys back in the toy box and just pop them on this mat with her baby walker and any other walkers that we get over the months, years. It can go on this play mat. I think it looks fine. Otherwise, this is a wasted space anyway. No one's going to sit behind the sofa and play. This is a good place. Away from the TV, concentrate on playing. Yeah, it's good. I'm gonna leave it here. I think oh, this is a good man. space. What? The lighting is beautiful outside right now. Sun's saying it looks amazing. All I can hear is Jason Miller. <laughs> <Hayler. laughs> They're too excited, man. Make the chill. All right, while, while Rod is having a little feed, I'm gonna set this table up, which is gonna go here with a nice fat lamp on. I don't think I do need tools for this table. I think it's just a hand yeah. jobby one. I've got a toolkit coming tomorrow on Amazon, but obviously that's coming tomorrow, not tonight. So we might be limited to what we can do today, but we'll see how we get on. Oh my gosh, it's crawling. Oh my gosh, you were crawling there. What the heck? I keep missing it on camera. 
she's when she gets preoccupied, she does it. Right, I'm going to just move this to here. She's going to be in the background. Oh, she's sat back up herself as well. She's so clever. She's really coming along now. I'm just going to film her. Because when I put the camera on her, she hates it. Well, she doesn't hate she it. She knows. That's what she she knows, that's what I mean, yeah. She knows and then she stops. She's a big girl and we love her all the world. She's a little baby girl. Butch touchy girl, it's the butchy touchy world. Go on, Laura. Laura. So I get too carried away, I don't even know my child's name. <laughs> I've got too many as well. Oh my god. Oh, I can't get this thing in here then. I can't even assemble the laundry basket. There we go, all done. Absolute bag in this was. Where's the, there we go. Is it going there like that? Fits nice, nice and snug. So we bought two of these. Is that right? What's this for? What's the Velcro? No, but what's the Velcro? Oh. It's because the lid flips off. Can you see the Velcro back to you? Oh. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. What about that then for a cool little laundry basket? No, Love it. it. No, it wasn't going to fit. But we've got one of them for laundry. That I'm just going to take through. Oh, and you've got you watch Aurora. Got one for the laundry room for washing, lights and darks. And then we've also got one under here for shoes. Cool. Right, so it's not quite fitting. <laughs> it's about that much too wide to fit on the laundry on the washing machine so I think I might just leave it stood up on the top works just the same open the door jobs a good one it's like a little cupboard <laughs> I literally can't go <laughs> um what on earth is going on out here? What's this? You ready? One minute, Isla. Mila, what are you doing? You're going to get stuck in there. Yeah, you You're going to get stuck. <laughs> you nearly <laughs> three. She likes to play kitten and pretend she doesn't want to do it. But do you actually want to do it? Yeah. <laughs> do it, actually, actually do it, actually, actually do it. <laughs> <laughs> My day. <laughs> we just just got a little Amazon delivery. <laughs> Amazon man just came. Oh my gosh. It's all this. Jesus, I don't know. I do not it's know. All kinds of bedding, yeah. Let's get it all inside. Oh, my husband in here. Uh, I think you do, Vaza. <laughs> oh my goodness! This looks so exciting. We've got the kitchen essentials. Oh, how I've missed this. <laughs> I got some new toys for my girl. Who got some new toys for Rory? Little haul. I got me and Chris a water bottle as I don't remember all in that colour, but that's all good. I like that is massive. Humongous. Comes with multiple lids, which is essential. Nice. Um, and then, because me and Chris didn't have a water bottle basically, me and Chris are going out, like saying to the kids, can I, can I drink your water? I bought one when we got here, a pink one, and I absolutely love it. But I kind of stole it, which I don't mind because everyone needs, everybody needs, don't mind, just come on when I moved then. Everyone needs cold water when we're out. Yes, darling. We also got a tea sugar coffee. This was actually super cheap. I was so tired of looking for things the other night that I was like, I don't care. Any, just put any in the basket. So we ended up with Hey Sugar, uh, best, oh sorry, but first tea. It's really funny writing. I couldn't actually work out what I just said. But first tea and then get coffee. But these look really bad. These were so cheap. They were literally like, £4 or something, £5 maybe. I 
Do you know what? They're actually decent. I'm not gonna lie. Like, we got a load of strip lights, galaxy light projector thing in my bobby do. We got a load of bedding, loads of duvets, duvet covers, sheets, um, pillows. We got another light projector. A little rainbow one. I got two packs of this just because when you're out, my skin always goes so dry when I'm on holiday, when I'm out in the sun all day. So I always like to keep my skin properly moisturized. So I got two bottles of that. What's this? Oh, there's some lovely garden lights. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I hope, you don't, I hope you don't only get five bulbs. Oh no, you get 15. What are these for? This is nice. To go around the gazebo. Oh, How nice will that look? I bought what? The waste I got the bin. Yeah, there's other stuff in that box. There's a box full of treasures there. But I'm not going to show everything because it's a bit boring for all of you guys. You've got Isabel's lights there because I put them up now. Isabel's lights? Yeah, yeah. These yeah, LEDs. I got your water bottle. Oh, babe, Alright, back at the holiday home. I mean, Esme and tag teaming it with dinner tonight. Esme is doing a pasta arrabbiata dish. And I'm cooking my carnivore steaks and eggs. Yeah, let's go, man. I cut it up. I've got a mouthful of it. Dragon fruit. It's so good. And I'm going to give Aurora some for the first time. So I've just cut four little strips here. That's more sweet than the one we had at home. Do you like them? Mm -hmm. They're much more cheaper than they are at home as well. I'm filming from down here because she got no clothes on. Because she's eating pasta and she stains all the clothes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even when we put a bib on. When we pop a bib on, you still manage to get up her sleeves. So, how do you like that dragon fruit? She actually just ate a banana. And now she's having dragon fruit. Let me try and give you another piece. There we go. Do you like that? Is it yummy? Go. Yum, 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 yum.